Here he goes, he's right here. Hi, buddy. A water bottle fish trap. Oh, oh. What's up, Raw Fam, and welcome back to my crazy psycho channel. Today, we're out here by the 3,000 gallon pool pond. Jaws is nice and fat and fluffy and he's stuffed to the brim, but just because, you know, he is full doesn't mean that baby Jaws isn't. But today, we're gonna be making a Gatorade fish trap. This is my secret minnow spot. You guys can tell no one. And guys, please act like you've never even seen this spot before because rely on this spot to feed baby Jaws, of course. So we're here. I actually just had to hurry up and finish my Gatorade. Not sponsored by Gatorade. <laughs> if you want to be sponsored, hit me up. To, of course, feed baby jaw. So let me take off the Gatorade. It's not Gatorade. Sponsored by No Name. Get your No Name. So real quick, I'm going to show you guys how to make a fish trap out of a Gatorade bottle. We're going to take right there on that seal. Ah, pierce it right there. There you go. Perfect. Now we're going to take some scissors and cut it out. And the little lid will fit perfect. Oh, no. Dang it, I messed up. So today we're gonna to be making a water bottle fish trap <laughs> using the same steps I just showed you. I'm gonna cut this baby in half, flip the head, put it in, and we're going to have our water bottle fish trap. Beautiful. And because the water bottle is not uneven, this will just sit perfectly like that. Now you take a couple little fishing hooks, pierce it in, and then, you know, that trap isn't going anywhere. So let me show you guys what I mean by that. So you are going to take your little water bottle, set it up like if it was already going to be a trap. And this is our smaller version of this trap. I've made them bigger than this, smaller than this. Um, this is, you know, just like the stereotypical, you know, fish trap for minnows, essentially. So then you guys put your bread in there, then, you know, the bread gets all nasty and soggy and stuff, and then it gives off that white mist that the fish absolutely love. And then, you know, the white mist goes out of here, all the little baby minnows and stuff smell it. They, you know, swim right in, and then baby jaws goes, Quapow! You guys good? You guys, you guys good? You, you, yeah. you guys chilling right there? Yeah, of course you guys are, because you guys are the fastest, strongest fishing family on YouTube. And of course, we're going to, you know, set our trap. But guys, we have to put bait in there, guys. So, um, yeah, I'm kind of lazy. I didn't feel like going to Walmart. So, uh, hello, Burger King. So, if you guys look right in here. Hello, Mr. Double Cheeseburger. Perfect. <laughs> so this is our bait, our hamburger buns. Guys, literally the best bait in the world. Don't quote me on it. So we're going to take this little piece of bread, you know, smush it up, and then start dumping it in. And because today we're feeding baby jaws, we don't need that big of baits. Whoa. We can literally just shove it in the weeds and catch a bunch of little minnows. So you guys have your fish trap with a little bit of bait in there. You take, you know, your hamburger buns, put it in there and essentially walk down to the water and pray and just hope for the best. I'm gonna go right here. You guys ready? Oh. <laughs> guys, be careful, geez. See the little bread floating? Raw fam, I just walked over to the trap and this is literally what I saw. If you guys could look really close, there's actually a bunch of little cichlids or nothing little about those guys. Some massive cichlids trying to get into that little trap. Guys, maybe we should come back and do a big cichlid trap and try and see if we could feed my red tail. Now I'm gonna see if I can sit back as far as possible and let those little guys, you know, do their magic, let the trap work because those bigger fish are gonna give up soon, realizing they cannot get inside that trap and they're not gonna get no bread out. So then they're just gonna give up and then the little guys are gonna and say, hey, I could fit perfectly in here. So let's do it. Let's, you know, give it 10, 15 more minutes and then check the trap. All right, Raw fam, the time is upon us. Let's do it. Bro, where's the trap? <laughs> oh, it's hidden. Guys, these, these little, um, these not, there's nothing little about these guys. These big cichlids are hitting the trap and literally moving it because it's so light. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh my goodness. Oh yes. Oh yes. Oh yes. Oh yes. Oh yes. Hey, what's good you rock fam? Hey, hey, hey. Oh yeah, Rafael. Oh yeah, we gotta do the buggy. Oh yeah, we got a bunch of awesome little baits. Let me come right here, guys. Heck yeah, Rolf. Give me some Dylan. Heck yeah, and you guys obviously saw those massive, you know, big ones. Um, I guess they finally gave up and gave the little guys a chance to go in the trap. Just do it like this, so. Oh, I see a couple mines in there. Okay, oh, so our first little bait is a beautiful little molly. Put that little guy in. Down. The next one's a little rock, deuces. We got, oh, nope, come here. Hey, buddy. We got a little beautiful Mayan cichlid. We got another Mayan cichlid and a rock. We got a little molly and a plane. So I can't believe the trap really worked this well. You know, I'm actually very grateful that, you know, the trap did work. Now I don't have to go back home to Baby Jaws and have to take my little quap pow So we have these beautiful little bait fish. Now we're gonna hop up in the truck, you know, put them in their cooler. So come on. Ugh. Come on, buddy. So as you guys can see, a bunch of little baits right here. Welcome to your new home, guys. For a little bit until you guys get eaten by jaws. So I'm gonna go off and throw the cast net one time and see if I could get a couple of those um, those little cichlids, a green tilapia, blue tilapia, anything like that, you know, to feed my massive red tails. Because you know, this little trap isn't gonna catch one of those big things. So let me do that real quick. Everyone makes mistakes. Woo! Look. Holy crap, I got way too many. <laughs> Come here, you trap killers. A four. Bunch of Mayan cichlids invasive to South Florida. Now Jaws food. Welcome. Welcome to the Raw Fam. So I think we satisfied everyone. We made a little fish trap today and caught some food for baby Jaws. And we got a little extra for Jaws and we got some for the Red Tails. Let's get over there and feed our beautiful babies some, you know, some fresh food that we just caught just now. So I love you all, fam. Let's get over there. So we just got back over to the pond. And if you guys look right here, I have a bunch of awesome, beautiful little baits. It might be a little dark, don't worry about it. We have, you know, a bunch of cool little baby fish, including Baby Jaws, right here. Let's say hi to Baby Jaws. He should be right here. Hi, Baby Jaws, come love me. Oh, 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 he's already here. See Baby Jaws? Okay, now we have a little molly right here. We're gonna feed it to Baby Jaws. You ready? Go Baby Jaws, you ready? Look right there. Bam! Oh, oh, Jaws! Baby Jaws! It's over, Raw fam! Ding, ding, ding! Round one is complete! That was Baby Jaws. He's very cool, but you know what's even cooler than Baby Jaws? Big Jaws! Of course, guys, everything is obviously cooler when it's bigger, so we just went and fed Little Jaws, both of them, and now we have Big Jaws with this perfect little tilapia, or, you know, cichlid. Here you go, Jaws. Ready, buddy? Oh my goodness, guys. Guys, can you hear it? Ding, ding, ding. Jaws, the winner of round numero dos, right? Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, seis, siete, ocho. I don't know that many, so I'm gonna run out soon. <laughs> so of course, guys, we gotta keep getting bigger and better, and this is our biggest bait we have in the bucket. Guys, comment down below. Do you guys think my red tail could eat this? Me, personally, I think he's going to absolutely annihilate this little bait. I think... <gasps> I think Jaws could eat it, but we're not gonna feed it to Jaws. We're gonna feed it to the Red Tail, so let's do that. Come here. Hi, Mr. Red Tail. What's up, Raw fam? Here he goes, he's right here. Hi, buddy. Hi, zoom in. Oh, oh, oh my goodness. Please tell me you got it. Wow! <laughs> Guys. That is my beautiful red tail catfish, guys, and he loves the raw fam, and he wanted to say, hi, raw fam, and guys, obviously, my red tails are trained. They know whenever I'm here to feed them. They hear, you know, the little splishy and splashies, and they absolutely love it. So we're gonna feed the other red tail and maybe even the big one again, so let's do it. Hi, Mr. Red Tail, come here, buddy. Oh, oh, Jaws, Jaws. <laughs> that was supposed to be red tail food and he creamed it. That is a Mayan cichlid. 
Come here, baby. Come on. Let's go. Come on. Oh, yummy, 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 yummy. Delicioso. <laughs> Dora. All right, Raw Fam, so that is gonna be the end of today's awesome, crazy little feeding. Guys, that was my beautiful baby jaws, and then we went up to beautiful big jaws, and then we went up. <laughs> What's up there? A tree. Um, yeah, and then we went up to the beautiful big red tails. And of course, you know, that was so cool. It was so fun. If you guys like today's awesome, crazy video, make sure you guys go down there, smash the subscribe button, and join the Raw Fam. All right, Raw fam, so that is gonna be the end of today's awesome, crazy adventure. We went off and we made a beautiful little, you know, stereotypical fish trap. Um, just an average water bottle fish trap, nothing special. We caught a bunch of cool little baits. We had a lot of fun, and obviously we just fed our beautiful little, you know, our little fish <laughs> collection, our little fish fam, and we had so much fun doing it. So without further ado, everybody say bye, Jaws. Bye, buddy. Let's pull it back, Raw Fam. And I love you, Raw Fam. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Boo!